Welcome to Vlogmas Day 24! If you're watching this, happy Christmas Eve. I hope you're doing something very festive today. You know what? It is Vlogmas Day 24, but it's also day two of getting in the cold pod every day, which is what I'm doing right now. I'm hoping to be less of a wimp today. I've also got to be quicker because I've got an hour and a half until I'm going around my uncle's house for breakfast. I have eaten a little science sign already because I'm hungry as soon as I wake up, but we've got like brunch at 11 at his house with my mum's family so that should be nice and by my mum's family I literally mean my uncle my sister and her boyfriend <laughs> that's it <laughs> right we're gonna be really quick this morning because as I said I've got to get ready so no fussing about Darcy I'm not gonna lie it feels colder today because well I think it's gonna be a sunny day so yeah like my feet right now because I'm just not wearing anything on my feet very very cold Ooh, got a bikini on under my pajamas Oh God, it's colder today. Oh God, it's really cold today. Ouch. <laughs> okay, there was so much for not being a wuss today. But it's freezing, I think, because it's been there overnight where the temperature obviously drops, so the water is so much colder. But yeah, I'm gonna go have a hot shower now. I'm ready to go to my uncle's house now, and I've got a little jumper dress on. I am going to wear tights because it's very, very short. If you watch yesterday's Vlogmas, you'll see that I made tiffin, and it's time to slice it up. I'm actually really glad that I'm cutting this up at this time, considering I've not eaten much today and I'm saving myself for the breakfast my uncle's gonna put on. I did have a slice of toast earlier actually, but that's because I wake up at like 7 a.m. and I'm starving. But yeah, it's a good thing I'm cutting it up now because it means I can resist. Whereas if I was cutting it up in the evening, I'd be like, oh, I'll just have a little bit. Whereas I'm just gonna slice it all up and put it in the freezer. And here we have the finished tiffin ready to go in the freezer. I just wrap it up in foil. It looks good, doesn't it? Can you see why I wanted the fudge? Without the fudge, it's just nowhere near as good. Head check. The head check. Yeah. That's something very glamorous, please. Thank you. It really wasn't, but I'm just pulling my skirt down. <laughs> I was at Andrew's, who's my uncle, by the way, um, for a couple of hours, literally just chatting, had breakfast, and smoked salmon and egg and avocado. It was really nice. I don't often have smoked salmon because it's really expensive. And smoked salmon's weird. I love the flavor of it. But then halfway through as I'm eating smoked salmon, it kind of creeps me out. I'm suddenly hit with the realization that it's technically raw fish. And I know it's been smoked, so it's not raw. It's got the same texture as if you were to go to the fridge and get a regular fillet of salmon and just bite it. I did get a little bit creeped out. Now, we are going for a walk, it's just me and Elliot. Elliot is looking at houses because he's got an obsession with buying a house. He's always on right move. This boy doesn't go on TikTok, he just scrolls right move like an absolute freak. You'll be grateful one day, I'll get the bargain. <laughs> absolute bargain. Thankfully I'm not in the boots, I do not have the facilities right now to even consider buying a house. So it just would be a complete and utter waste of time. Yeah, we're going for a walk and we're gonna go get a coffee because later we're going to the pub because apparently there's some sort of game on TV where they kick a ball about and it's a really important one. So we've got to go and watch it. Don't play dumb, you know exactly <laughs> what it's about. That's obviously why I painted my nails red today. To support Arsenal, Arsenal v Tottenham. No, Liverpool. Thank you. Arsenal v Liverpool and it's a huge game. And if we win this, no, if we win or draw, then we're top of the league for Christmas. And that would be the best possible Christmas present I could ever ask for. So yeah, that would be really good. One of Elliot's advent calendars was this double. Oh my God, it actually is double. I got it from TikTok shop. So I was thinking it was like a dupe, like a double dupe, but it's actually the real deal. Do you get many cards in it though? I'm having slight regrets about cutting my fringe given I've just washed it and it's like, it's dried really funny. It kind of looks like it's been burnt off. But yeah, my hair is still kind of wet and it's not been styled, but we're heading to the pub. So I'm just gonna put the hat on. We are at the Globe. The Globe pub, here we come. Here's what she's looking like. 
We're getting here a little bit early, so hopefully we can get a table because I don't really like standing about, you know? I don't want to stand watching the football because I'm not really here to watch the football. I've got some cards. What are you here for then? <laughs> I'm here for the booze. No, I'm not. <laughs> Shut up, no mercy. We're about to play Uno No Mercy. So it's like regular Uno, so it's got crazy cards, like plus 10. You probably can't hear me because the football's just starting. The game has just got interesting because they've got karaoke at eight and Elliot said if Arsenal win that he's going to do I'm just Ken in karaoke. I've never been so invested in a game before. Unfortunately, I'm not even sure if you'd have heard that. Basically, we were watching the football and there was karaoke on at eight and Elliot said, well, actually I said to Elliot, if Arsenal wins, will you sing I'm Just Ken during the karaoke? And he said yes, because he thought the chances of Arsenal winning very slim, which is controversial considering he's an Arsenal fan. Arsenal didn't win, so Elliot didn't do karaoke. You know what? We even stayed till the karaoke to come on, but it never came on. So yeah, we only had two drinks, but it was fun, you know? It was a good time. It's Christmas Eve Eve and tomorrow's Christmas Eve. So we thought best not have too many drinks. We'll just have the two, then come home. And it's currently in the co-op and he's looking for custard. And he's obviously finding it really hard because he's been in there for like 10 minutes. And because he's so tall, I can see his head over the aisles. <laughs> and he keeps going up and down looking for custard. <laughs> Elliot's got custard in his hand and I can see him counting pennies to see if he's got enough money. <laughs> Look, he's like, oh, I don't know if I can quite afford this custard. <laughs> custard is bloody, he's going for that co-op finest custard. <laughs> he's getting it. <laughs> the Custard Chronicles. I'm probably gonna end the vlog here. So thank you for watching. If you're watching this on Christmas Eve, I hope you've had a very good day and I hope you're looking forward to Christmas tomorrow.